hello traders i'm back here with my best analysis and the best trades of the day i hope you guys had a nice day today and today is 22nd of january 2021 and during today's analysis review i'm also going to say, share with you some useful information especially for those novice traders so pay attention uh, you might find some useful information that's going to help you to enhance your trading skill especially for those traders who are struggling in forest trading and if you would like to know how I help all the traders through live intraday analysis, uh, practically is a live coaching and training through live market. Uh, please watch that video and the video link is given somewhere in the video description. And I'm also offering free one to one consultation if you are interested to discuss your forex trading challenges or if you are interested how to learn uh, forex trading effectively successfully in live trading environment. Uh, my availability calendar link is also given somewhere in the video description so feel free to book i'm also going to share with you uh the trades which was open yesterday uh, and we already banked beautiful few pips we had let one trade open i'm going to give you that update of that trade all right so let's back to the system okay guys we had a quite <clears throat> interesting day today we had a couple of good uh short trades especially in pound dollar uh we can see beautiful pips uh, amazing trades as you can see here pound dollar beautiful breakout beautiful trades uh, we were short since in the morning and then we take an account a long trade um i think is uh, at the new york session all right so one of my traders you can see bank 143 pips just to recap quickly guys these are the uh, intraday analysis alongside with the four hour analysis i analyze market twice a day uh, just before london open and 7 30 gmt and just before opening bell 2 p.m and all the live analysis recording instantly available in the training section also broadcast all this analysis in the analysis section so based on the uh, today's analysis one of my trader bank 143 pips then this is the breakdown of these trades uh, as you've seen this trade was open yesterday um, and he banked 35 pips let me share with you guys uh, this was the opening uh, screenshot and that's the closing uh, when the price profit target hit that was the 200 ema price nicely hit to the profit target all right so let me share with you uh, about the four hour and the useful information which you can apply to any pair okay so dollar cad this is i'm just going to open to the four hour if you look at in four hour uh yesterday uh, we had it uh, especially when we see the price uh, break any major support and resistance or if we see any rejection uh, let's suppose you can see this price broken um, daily um, support level yesterday and after this candle you can see here purely bearish rejection candle uh, and the price came back because this was the support level yesterday today uh, basically yesterday broken and then become a resistance as soon as the price reverse we count this one as a false breakout so every time when you found any false breakout and then next thing is when to enter that's what we use it our intraday system and uh, let me share with you the in our intraday system but you can use a uh, five minutes charts or 15 minutes charts it's up to you guys uh, but we have our own intraday system which help us to basically be using it to reduce the market noise so let me share with you this is the analysis uh, what we we were watching okay let me make it bigger so explain to you guys a bit further okay so let me bring this four hour chart so you can see here <clears throat> for our chart and that's what we did uh, price was at this level and then we did intraday analysis we explained to our trader that this is the false breakout you can see here even in intraday and we look at here we said okay this is the false breakout even four hour so what we're looking here we technically we're looking a breakout and the more safer trade which we explained to our trader if the price is going to break and retest that's going to give us the confirmation then we should be taking a long trade because we already have the confirmation false breakout in four hour that's what we basically we decided and that's what we explain in live uh, in analysis and through live rd commentary so you can use a five minute chart or 15 minutes chart it's up to you guys but we're using this intraday system so we need a confirmation that's basically high probability trade so 
what happened after that if i remove this one four hour charts you can see here exactly <clears throat> price broken and after the broken price retest that's give us the confirmation plus if you look at here you can see this is the shoulders and this is a head that's give us the confirmation and but as based on the we have defined our sentiment our bias in the four hour based on that so then <clears throat> once the momentum is developed bullish then we basically only interested uh, pull back long so every time when the price you know uh, develop a pullback and if that pullback coordinate with the major uh, support level which is you can see here previous high broken then we said okay beautiful momentum bullish because the risk reward point of view we take a long trade here put a stop loss here so beautiful long trade here so this is what exactly where we do it but you can use a five minutes or 15 minutes chance if you don't have this system all right guys so this is what exactly we did and he banked 35 pips then he opened another pullback which is i can show you here uh, you can see this is the screenshot uh opening price and this is the closing price when the price hit first and the second final target as you can see here so this is beautiful trade he made a 55 pips and 35 pips in the london morning session uh, because friday friday mostly traded be conservative in terms of trading so at the new york session <clears throat> that was an interesting thing we were communicating it he take a loss i think two pips and uh, let me share with you this was the analysis and uh, he, he decided because we were communicating he said look the price looked like his developed head and shoulder pattern probably is going to be come back and i said to my traders look at as long as the momentum is bullish then we did another analysis in four hour let me share with you guys that four hour analysis uh, this is the four hour and we explained to traders if the price is going to this is the red line is a monthly uh, support that level because we seen this candle and the trader was expecting probably we're going to have a short trade i say guys this is the major support in monthly support line so if the price is going to break then we're taking a short trade otherwise we should be taking a long trade so what happened which is quite natural you can see the price came back just below this uh, 26 uh, 874 uh, level and the trader was thinking oh he's going to come down so you take a short trade as soon as the price reverse i said guys pay attention to it and i did this analysis i said to you guys uh, let me share with you that analysis this is the analysis we explained to look for if the price gonna break which price literally came back and broken but as soon as we momentum basically developed bullish refused to come back because we're watching in four hour that major major support level so he quit that trade and basically he opened another position long position which is you can see here exactly he closed in open price and you can see at the bottom the momentum was developing bullish that's a pretty straightforward and he added another one so he banked another one this one at 36 pips you can see this is the entry and this is the closing price uh, which we mentioned to bank some profit at that time and he opened added another one he added only another one on the winning not in the losing remember never add more trades on losing so he added another one in winning he took 18 pips profit on this one other one he took like 36 pips you can see beautiful uh, trade so you can see he mainly focused on the dollar cat even though we had a beautiful trade but as i said to you uh we tell all traders to you need to be specialized in one trader and you need to maximize the most opportunities so just even one pair you can see he banked manage 143 pips two i believe two in the london morning session i think one is a london no i think one is a london morning session and other one you can see it the rest of them is just like at the new york session so you can see he just focused on the one pair and manage 43 pips so i hope you understand all right so let me share with you a couple of more analysis today and then we can looking forward for the weekend all right so okay so let me what's happening here okay so this is the okay <clears throat> what we're looking here 
uh, that's another more important thing guys again is a more or less the same example we had it for dollar cad if you look at in pound dollar and uh, let me share with you the pound dollar four hour so then you will understand what i'm talking here uh, in four hour you can see here this morning we were short we were taken because this line yellow line or orange line whatever is the daily support line and the price broken and we explained to trader which you can see the candle is closed below this 37,000 area which is what we're looking into it then we take a short trade and then we take a pullback short trades on this one as soon as the price hit to the support level we said okay there is a possibility price might going to reverse but we don't have any confirmation in four hour candlestick and that's why we go into the smaller time frame uh to find the you know refine the entries but as i said to you we look at in the intraday system this is what we exactly we do it so we did that analysis and that analysis was let me clear these things and let me explain to you this is another beautiful analysis you can see here uh, <clears throat> the most important thing we communicate uh with our traders through live audio commentary so technically we were looking at this level pullback can you see we have any pullback no we didn't see any pullback and that's why this candlestick help us to find if the price is going to reject so we didn't see any pullback price broken perfectly fine and look here what i said to you in the analysis if the price break and retest then we should be taking a long trade number one number two what do you see here you can see here this is the support level broken so technically based on the price action normally price respect this level if not this level but you see the price did not respect this level yeah we didn't see any pure pullback here uh, normally we can't pull back if we see two red candles but we haven't seen any pullback so price broken so we count this one as a false breakout number one okay got it second we need a confirmation and the confirmation is if the price break retest we got this confirmation and that's help us basically okay and look at the bottom momentum was developed bullish so this 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 help us and then we take another long trade here and then of course we take the nice ride because as long as the momentum is bullish we announce all these pullbacks you can see here as always we count that 200 ema in our intraday system as a trend um, so as soon as the price that's all the first target as you can see beautiful at that time we announced through live audio commentary and through analysis to consider the bank some profit so guys if you don't have this system you can use five five minutes charts but you can apply the same methodology and you can bank beautiful pips guys uh, always look major support and resistance in a high time frame get into the shorter time frame and find the better price action and enjoy the pipping all right so let me quickly quickly do it okay guys pretty straightforward sideways market beautiful breakout long trade pound yen we had another beautiful this one again you can see here beautiful breakout as always breakout retest beautiful long trade then we had it pound yen beautiful this is the beautiful breakout trade uh, london morning session beautiful trade and pound dollar uh, pretty straightforward as you can see this was the trade in the morning session we took this short trade we had this beautiful pullback this was the beautiful pips and that was the amazing i also banked beautiful pips on this one could not resist it when the price basically developed a beautiful pullback short trade let me share with you that trade and then i'm gonna wind up i think that's the one yeah <clears throat> that's the one you can see here we had a short trade breakout as i mentioned in four hour afterwards beautiful pullback and you can see price nicely hit to the previous level and then i bank some profit so that's what this was the beautiful pullback short trade all right guys i hope you enjoyed today's analysis all right so if you would like to see all that analysis in real time with the live rd commentary support if you would like to develop your trading skill in real time uh, or if you need a forest coaching and training we provide for forest coaching and training through this platform or even if you are an experienced trader i'm pretty sure my friend you're gonna love to bank all that pips so most welcome to join my fast growing trader community 
and if you are a successful trader and you need some funding we also provide you know trading funds uh, all the successful trader who produce good pips on the platform all right guys have a nice weekend hope you enjoyed this video and i look forward to see you on monday with another analysis wish you all the best and i'll see you next time take care